Hey everyone, it's Joe Lyons here in Dallas, Texas. Yeah, and Jackie here from Copenhagen, Denmark. So this is just a short and sweet uh, video. I wanted to, uh, we were we were closing out the uh, the drawing for the winner of the fifty dollars Amazon gift prize, and um, I think there's two winners for. Uh, oh crap! Which means I'm gonna have to um, do that one separately. Uh, there's a chance to win uh, two Udemy courses uh, from us. But um, let me let me share the other view here real quickly. Here we go. So um, on the Autic user survey, we're keeping it open. So I'll, I'll put the link in the description of this video if you still if you didn't take it, or you know still love your input. Um, but right now we got 412 completes and 117 partials. So this is awesome, which will give us 529. Depending, you know, at the start of the survey we have more, and people fall out kind of you know as we go back to the end. But this is a great amount of data. It will give us some really really good insights. Um, probably the next webinar in January will re review the results. Uh, yeah. So it's going to be some, it's going to be really fun looking, Jackie. To, um, I was telling Jackie earlier, I was trying to find the script that he created back in, what was that, May of 2016 uh, yeah. when we did the drawing. Yeah. Uh, it boy. Thereabouts, yeah. I just noticed um, someone, someone, I'm surprised no one's complained that the auto hot key, because I calculated that it the case. I'm, I forget who that was. If someone complained at me for quite a while, anyway, um, I I do remember who it was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so, uh, what was really cool, uh, and I, and thankfully, um, I found the script that Jackie wrote back back then, and it's so this what we didn't we didn't actually share it, so that was part of the problem. Um, so I'm going to share this one uh, after we do the drawing, and now this is going to cycle over those. Um, people that completed the survey and entered an email address uh, into the survey to be in the drawing for the winning. Um, and what's cool with this is, so I have a text file that, uh, which is where, right? Uh, it was a little lower, right? Somewhere. Yeah, you're past it now. Oh, thank you. Uh, there we go. Girl. Yeah. Yeah. So I put a text file here that just has, you know, the respondent ID so I can go look up their email address. This way we don't risk sharing anyone's email address. Uh, but it has like their first name, the city they're in, the uh, maybe country, I can't remember, but state they're in uh, and the country they're in. Um, and so this will be for the, the $50 Amazon gift prize. So uh, Jackie made this. Oh, that was pretty cool. So let me, let me launch it. Um, and Jackie, because it's going to take a minute, why don't you explain as it's running what it's doing? Yeah, if if I truly could remember what it was doing. But yeah, here <laughs> it's, it's using a, a simple sort and then just uh, narrowing down uh, every time it iterates over them um, until you end up with only uh, very few and then one in the end. All right, so Angel, it uh, looks like a Tijuana, Mexico. Hmm. Um, congratulations. So uh, we'll uh, post this somewhere and I'll, I'll you know, um, I'll, I'll probably send you an email first um, before I make sure that we send the gift card to that email address. But congratulations on that. And then, like I said, I'll I'll do a different drawing just because we had this. I thought it was really cool to reuse what we did four years ago, almost yeah. almost f coming up on five. I and mean, that's that's crazy. Yeah. So uh, congratulations. Thank you all for completing the survey. Um, Absolutely. This year, we, we purposely kept a lot of the survey the same. Um, we trimmed out stuff that we just didn't think was needed anymore. I added a few things, but not a lot. But what's going to be really cool is to see the changes between, you know, from four years ago, right? The, the changes are now who's using it and what. Um, so that should be fun and interesting. Yeah, because we've talked so much about uh, how long people stay and how many new people come in. That's That's one of the things that I really... Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing if, if that trend still holds. Mm -hmm. I did notice um, real quickly it, uh, and that's, I can't remember where I jumped to it, but um, the uh, tenure for people taking this, um, uh, people using auto hotkey was quite high, uh, which I think mm -hmm. it was before. And that was one of the things I actually changed slightly. I didn't, I kept all the groups most of them the same, but one of them, and I can't remember what it was, maybe it was like the, you've been using auto hockey five plus years. Maybe we had it something like that. And I think yeah. I subdivided that one up to be like five to 10 and 10 plus, because we had a fair amount um, in one. So, but we can always collapse them together and compare apples to apples. Yeah. But um, yeah, it, it, it is fascinating to me. The, the other one I looked at it, it in, um, I think it looked like more people this time had selected hot strings. Cause for me, that's a, 
it's a passion, right? Um, I, I think it, it looked like, if I remember right, more people had said they were using them this time than last time. So um, it looks going to be interesting to see, you know, how they're using it, what they're using it differently. Yeah, uh, lots of cool yeah. stuff. Yeah. Cool. Well, thank you. And thanks again, Jackie, for writing this back then. It's going to be fun to, to, to look at the results. Yeah, absolutely. Cheers. Yeah. Okay, so we realized, um, Jackie realized, all we have to do is just uh, rerun the thing. And, uh, you know, if we have the same first place winner, then we'll just rerun again. But let's go ahead and launch this. It's going to be cycling through. Um, yeah, so this whole thing is built with AutoHotKey, right, with the GDI yeah. library. Yeah, and it, it simply displays everybody in the list at, at the start and then reduces the participants. Okay, so there's uh, Tim Champagne. Oh, sorry, Tim from Champagne in Illinois. Um, I think yeah. I've actually been there. So that's the second place. So let me, actually the second and third are, well, we'll still say. Second place winner, and then we'll relaunch this and do it again. Um, yeah. They're both the same prize, so. And if you're quick, you can see yourself in here. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's funny. I left us in, Jackie. If we win, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna have some complaints. <laughs> yeah, that's that's gonna be funny. Assuming you took it, I don't know if you did. Yeah, I, 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 I did. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and Matt from Tungleton Wilsburg, Kentucky. Uh, yeah. Cool. Awesome. So yeah. Now we're all done with that. Nice. Thanks again, everyone, for taking this. I know it's not a long survey, but um, what's really cool is the uh, the analysis we'll get be because I have a master's in market research and you know was a data science for twenty years. Um, I can do really cool advanced stuff. Um, so the uh, the results we'll get will be as if someone was paying you know twenty thirty grand for a, a study, and yet we get it done for free because I'm just doing the work. So. And, and, and we give up some prizes, sure enough. <laughs> Awesome. Well, thanks, man. Yeah, Cheers. absolutely.